Hi guys, welcome back to Zimzam Entertainment. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe and uh, click on the notification bell so that you get notifications every time I post new videos. If you are returning subscribers, you know it, you know it. I got nothing but love for you guys. I got nothing but love for you guys. Well guys, please don't forget, no YouTubers left behind. Please subscribe to other YouTube channels as well. Today's entertainment is about how today's women, or the Slay Queens rather, are behaving or misbehaving. Okay, so I visited somebody recently and uh, when I got to her house, she said to me, she actually asked me to get into her bedroom and she's married. Get into her, to go into her bedroom, that's, what, that's where she was doing stuff. And I was like, no, I will not just come out, you know. And I mean, like we were arguing for a good three minutes. So when she eventually came out, I sat her down and I was like, listen. So what I told her is basically what I'm going to talk about. So you guys, listen. A bedroom, your bedroom, especially if you are married, your bedroom should be your husband's sanctuary okay when you guys have visitors friends family come over they will have access to the bathroom access to the living room access to the kitchen access to the passage but they should not have access to the bedroom guys respect that bedroom okay basically i'm saying respect your husband enough not to let everybody see where he lays his head Hmm? seriously that man should be treated like a king okay he is your king so why would you let anybody see where your king puts his head huh? anybody everybody where sees where your king lies down why huh? and you know there's some women that they really don't care they will just invite anybody in, even if the bed is not made, not done, they will just invite everybody in and they're talking and even describing certain things that the husband did or does. Guys, chill. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill when it comes to your husband. Huh? Take a chill pill. You know, don't you wonder sometimes when women fall out, their friendship falls out, and uh, the disgruntled one starts describing certain things that only you thought you knew? You know, describing, oh, after all, the husband sleeps and on a, such and such a bed or in such and such a position or whatever. And some of those people are just playing mind games just to aggravate you. And because you forgot that you were careless, once upon a time you invited that friend into your bedroom, you just go ballistic and start accusing your husband of cheating. Hmm? When you are the one who started it. When you are the one who was careless and invited your friends to see where you... And you know sometimes, you know when things happen in the bedroom, there will be things lying around, lying everywhere, and you're going to invite your friends inside. Hmm? To see all those things so that they can see even the, 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 the underwear. Yeah? And someone will even describe, yeah, that red underwear or blue, black, green. And you start thinking, oh, my husband cheated. How else did she know she had a blue underwear or that he owns a blue underwear or red underwear? Girlfriend, you invited the devil into your bedroom. Bottom line, Maslai Queen. Or any ordinary human being, any ordinary woman, once you get married, please do not invite your friends into your bedroom. That is your man's only sanctuary. That is the only place he should feel comfortable and proud to be in. Knowing that nobody else has been in there except you. Okay? So, 
again do not let people into your bedroom even if you are showing them a house even if you buy a house and you're showing them around the best time to show people around a house is when you before you move in just when escrow closes maybe you can show people around but if they happen to come when you've already moved in skip the bedroom and let them know just i mean close the door and just say this is the manufacturing factory i leave it at that you know you don't have to show them and let them know that no i will not show you my uh, the bedroom where my husband sleeps there is nothing wrong with that the uh, elders that used to advise people way, way back when when they were when women got married they do understand and they will tell you do not invite friends into your bedroom let that man be a king in that bedroom let that man do whatever he wants to do in that bedroom knowing that nobody else will come and see whatever it is that he does even if he decides to hang his uh whatever's on the headboard or on the floor or whatever that should be between the two of you anyway i will leave this topic for now and of course we'll talk about relationship topics at a later stage okay so don't forget again no youtubers left behind so please subscribe to other youtube channels as well and remember i got nothing but love for you guys i got nothing but love for you guys all right guys take care love you bye